stage three, phase three, in order to get the 160 tooth gear onto the central column, you have to tilt the model up high enough to get the central shaft to drop down low enough. In order to do this, you tilt the model so high it could fall over on you. To avoid this problem, remove the temporary sun and remove the central shaft since it's not used until later on in the assembly. Now you can install the large plastic washer over the central column and place the 91 tooth gear on the central column making sure that it meshes with the other 91 tooth gear. Now you lock this gear to the central column by tightening the set screw with an allen wrench. Now take the 160 tooth gear and now that the central shaft is not in the way you can place this onto the central column without tilting the model. Make sure it meshes with the other gear next to it. Tighten it down with this allen wrench. Now if you like you can replace the central shaft into the model and replace the temporary sun. This step isn't really necessary if you're going to continue on with the assembly. In stage 4, phase 1, to remove the central column support, you have to lift the model up. With the central shaft in place, you could tip the model over. With the central shaft removed, all you have to do is tilt the model up high enough to get the central column support out from under the model.